Welcome to another episode of Reviews on the Run. Instead of doing an anime review today, we're going to talk about something that really piqued our interest. What are the 5 deadliest tourist attractions in the world so far? People risk their lives every year to get some sort of thrill and get most out of their money spent at these crazy attractions. Number 1. El Caminito del Rey, Spain. See this tiny little steel pad with no handrails? Yep, that's a 100 foot drop if you accidentally trip. Parts of the pathway have been crumbled and yet people still flock to to get their thrills. Number 2. Hua Shan Plank Path Walk China I apologize if I mispronounced the name. This trail is literally a leap of faith. Many climb it to get to the temples atop the mountain. The picture speaks for itself when I tell you it's the most dangerous hike in the world. There are some areas where there aren't even any planks and you just have to wedge your feet onto the cracks of the mountain face. Some say that 100 people die every year on the path, although there are no official statistics. Number 3. Mount Penutubo, Philippines. Sorry for mispronouncing. In 1991, the Mount Penutubo erupted unexpectedly and took within, within 800 lives. Again, in 1992, it erupted and killed 72 people. And yet, people still come from all over to hike the crater lake. That's big no for me, I guess. Number 4. Angels Landing Zion National Park. The climb is fairly difficult, but the danger comes from the high volume of people up on the narrow cliff top with sheer drops on each side. Number 5. Yosemite National Park Half Dome. This day long climb and with this terrifying cliff that you have to scale. 60 people have died on it. Two hikers who fell in 2001 had their body swept away by the rapid water below. Not only do you have to worry about falling, lighting has also struck the mountain face. Animals, uh, anyone else reminded of the wall of Game of Thrones? 